repeat. And repeat after me. Ready? Okay, the second three. All right, uh, we are ready. Okay. Number one, play basketball. Play basketball. I play basketball after school. I play basketball after school. Play the piano. Play the piano. I play the piano after school. I play the piano after school. Read comic books. Read comic books. I read comic books after school. I read comic books after school. Bake cookies. Bake cookies. I bake cookies after school. I bake cookies after school. Go camping. Go camping. I go camping after school. I go camping after school. Go jogging. Go jogging. I go jogging after school. I go jogging after school. Go swimming. Go swimming. I go swimming after school. I go swimming after school. All right, nice job, everyone. So those are some after school activities that some people like to do. Okay, let's go to page nine in our books. All right, repeat after me. We will read the story together. Everyone ready? Yes. Fred, I can't find my swimming cap. Fred, I can't find my swimming cap. Don't worry. Don't worry. Here it is. Here it is. Hi, my name is Robbie. Nice to meet you. Hi, my name is Robbie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. I have to go now. See you later. I have to go now. See you later. What does Prince Bruce do after school? He does his homework. He does his homework. What does Prince Bruce do on Sundays? What does Prince Bruce do on Sundays? He plays basketball and bakes pineapple cakes. He plays basketball and bakes pineapple cakes. What are you doing, Bruce? What are you doing, Bruce? I'm reading comic books. I'm reading comic books. Prince Bruce, it's time to do your homework. Prince Bruce, it's time to do your homework. In a minute. In a minute. You have to do it right now. You have to do it right now. What do you do on Saturdays? What do you do on Saturdays? Fred and I go camping. Fred and I go camping. Sorry, I can't go with you. Sorry, I can't go with you. No problem, I can help. No problem, I can help. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun. Wow, cool. Wow, cool. Okay, nice job, everyone. 
let's answer some questions. What time does Prince Bruce do his homework? Hmm. Nice job. Which is not true. Nice job. Go back to page 10 and look at Prince Bruce's weekly schedule. What does he do on Sundays? Raise your hand to answer the question. Sunday. Nice job. Yes, correct. Okay, look at Tuesdays. What does Prince Bruce do at 4 p.m. on Tuesdays? Very good. He plays the piano on Tuesdays. Nice job. And last question. What does Prince Bruce do at 8 a.m. on Fridays? Say it again. He has a science. Science class. Science class at a m. Nice job. Yes. All right. Great job, everyone. Does anyone have any questions so far? Questions. Okay, no. no. Raise your hand if your schedule kind of looks like Prince Bruce's. <laughs> no. <laughs> no one? That's all right. We all have different schedules. They all look different. All right. Nice job, everyone. So next we're going to do a worksheet called the weekly schedule worksheet. There are two parts, part A and part B. We will start with part A. All right. All right. In part A, read the clues and then fill in Ellie's weekly schedule. So, for example, number one, Ellie has lunch at 12 p.m. every day. It says lunch at 12 p.m. every day. Then they get a little harder. 
So let's t listen to number two. Ellie plays a sport with an orange ball at 3 o'clock p.m. on Thursdays and Fridays. What is she doing after school? So you can fill in what she's doing at the time. Orange ball, playing basketball. Very good. All right, make sure you write it in her schedule. Raise I think they gave it now. Great. That's <laughs> good. All right, let's look at number three. Okay, number three. Ellie is in the kitchen at 5 o'clock p.m. on Mondays. What is she doing after school? In the kitchen. Very good. Yes, baking cookies. <laughs> All the other activities. Can you do them in a kitchen? Not so much. <laughs> that might get a little crazy. <laughs> All right, nice job. Okay, ready for number four? Yes, please. Wonderful. Ellie is in a pool at 3 o'clock p.m. on Mondays and Wednesdays. What is she doing after school? She is swimming. Yes, nice job. Pool, all right, next one. Okay. Okay. Ellie reads a funny book at three o'clock p.m. until five o'clock p.m. on Tuesdays. What is she doing after school? Reading a book. Very good. Nice job. Ready for number six? Okay. Okay, last one. <laughs> Starting at six o'clock PM, Ellie spends Friday nights in a tent doing which activity? Say that again. Okay. 
Nice job. Yes. Goes camping. Nice job, everyone. On part B, we will answer the questions about Ellie's schedule. So read the question and write down the answer about Ellie's schedule. Number one says, what sport is Ellie playing after school on Thursdays and Fridays? Um, so, who wants to answer this question? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Nice job. Yes, correct. Great job. All right, number two. What is Ellie doing after school at 5 o'clock p.m. on Mondays? Can you say that one more time? Good, yes, correct. Ellie baking cookies after school on Mondays. Good. All right, number three. What is Ellie doing after school at 3 o'clock p.m. on Mondays and Wednesdays? Nice job. Very good. All right. Great job. Number four. What does Ellie do after school on Tuesdays? Nice job. All right. And final question. Last one. What is Ellie doing after school at 6 o'clock p.m. on Fridays? Ellie goes camping after school on Fridays. Nice job. Very good. All right, everyone. Does anyone have any questions? No. Okay. No? All right. Are you ready for a game? Yes. Okay. So, we all have done different things after school. We all have different interests. So, in this game, choose three after school activities from the list. Two of them you have done before. One, don't do. So two are true for you, and one is a lie. Keep these secret. When it is your turn, you will say the three things that you chose, and everyone else will try to guess which is the lie. Yeah, so could you give us uh, one example? So could you please tell us three things you do? Sure. Uh, uh, two truths. 
，他等一下要讲这个我们下面的活动啊，刚刚大家都有写过的活动，然后等一下你也要自己想三个，两个是真的你有做的活动，其中一个是 line， line 是谎话啊，你自己编造的，没有你没有做，然后我们要去猜哪一个，要看谁猜中啊 ，OK。All right, here are my three things. Three things. I go jogging after school. I play the piano after school. And I play basketball after school. Go jogging, play the piano, and play basketball. So anyone want to guess which one is a lie? 来，大家猜，老师刚刚讲，他其中有一个是谎话，不是真的。来，来，没说哦。So we have let's say we have four teams. Team A, Team B, Team C, Team B. 看哪一组？ Perfect. 哎，这哪一组可以猜中的哈？来，你们先猜哈。Team A， 等一下，轮流。来。啊 Huh? Go jogging is a lie. No, go jogging is true. Can we? Let me try. Play basketball. No, play basketball is true. Can we see a sun dog? I don't know. Play the piano. Oh, Correct. Okay. I don't know how to play the piano. <laughs> we thought you were a piano player. No, so a... I can sing. Okay. I don't know how to play the piano very well. <laughs> nice job. See, I tricked you. No, oh, good. Uh -huh. uh, now it's their turn. Okay. Yes. The first thing is I play basketball after school. Second thing is I read comic books after school. Comic books. Okay, number three. I go jogging after school. Go jogging. Okay. So, which team will guess first? You may not know. Ten side. But the. Basketball, comic books, and jogging. Jogging. Reading a comic book is a lie. Oh, so yeah, Team A got it right. Oh, nice job, Team A. 好，换听妹想一个，是谁？哎，你们，你们刚刚没有决定好，那你们等一下。我们要猜选决定。听妹有没有是猜谁当代表？要讲哪一个？来，先讲。Eighteen and nineteen. Uh, oh, okay. So, which team would like to guess? Basketball. Eighteen. Hello, camping. Camping. Okay. Team Team C on to guess. Camping is a lie. No. No. It's true. Yes. Okay. 还有其他主要猜的吗 ？Team B， 你们猜。来，你要猜吗？来一个，来。大家好，朋友们。来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，来，
Baking cookies is a lie. It's a lie. Okay. Ah. Oh. Oh, that. I go jogging after school. Go swimming after school. Swimming is the line? Oh, you got it. Okay. Nice job. Team, this turn, uh, team, please turn to the other three things. Great. Go oh, jumping. Jumping. Oh, camping. Sorry. Sorry. DJ, go camping. <laughs> oh, jumping. Sorry. So, jumping. Jumping, coming, books, and camping. And camping. Okay. Camping. Yeah. Okay. Camping is the right. Camping is the right. No, no, no. no. Uh, I say, uh, you may not do it. Camping is the right. So reading comic books is a lie. Okay. So we only have ten minutes left. So maybe we can Oh, questions? Okay. Who has a question? Okay. Yeah, not really tight what was that? Oh, it's a Korean band, I think. Not or Oh. It's a, I think it's a, a, a group from South Korea. Uh, oh. Do you listen to Korean pop song, I think? Ah, uh, okay. Good question. I have listened to some. I don't know a lot of songs or bands. <laughs> Do you like K-pop? Black, black pink. Do you like K-pop? Oh, oh. Smells very terrible, but tastes very good. Yeah. 
I have not tried it, but I have heard about it, and I would like to try it. Can you buy Bridget some stinky tofu when she is here? Okay. I like tofu, but I've never tried stinky tofu. Any other questions? Okay, then let's move on to the pasty game. Sure. All right. So each of these activities is pretty different, right? So for example, do you bake cookies inside or outside? Inside. Yes. How about swimming? Do you usually swim inside or outside? Swimming. Oh, either, right? Either, right. All right. And there are other ways to help describe these after school activities. For example, someone could ask, does it involve music? Which of these involves music? Uh, play the piano. Involve, this is all. Play the piano. Good. Yes. Which of these involves reading? Uh, reading. Reading comic books. Yes. All right. Good. So there are ways to describe these different activities. Okay. In our next game. Okay. So, uh, one person will come up and they will not look at me. Their back will be to the screen. I will write down oh. one of the activities. Everyone else must describe what I wrote, but cannot say the words, cannot say what it is. You have to describe it. Okay. So uh, let, let's say if team A, team A, team B, team B, team B, so if they send a, a representative to the front, then their team member will have to help the representative figure out your answer, right? Yes. Okay, so uh, let's start with team A. Hot seat, this is hot. Uh. Hot seat. <laughs> Okay, please. All right, are you ready? All right, here's the phrase. And uh, describe. Hey, hey, so. Ready, set. Uh, the, 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 the students ask question, right? Indoor or outdoor? Is it indoor or outdoor? Indoor or outdoor? Indoors 
or outdoors? Uh, they say either. either. Okay. Either. Does it involve? Water. Water. Water? Does it involve water? No. No. Does it? Does it involve, involve ball? Yeah. A ball? Yeah. A ball? Yeah. A ball? Yeah. A ball? Yeah. 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 Did you send one representative? Here is the half C. No? All right. We can see. Now, uh, you so does it involve? Okay, so is it indoors or outdoors? Does it involve music or such a thing? Ah, your Okay, please. All right, ready? <laughs> All right. Don't think you get one Is it indoors? Is indoors or outdoors? Or outdoors. Indoors. 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 Music. Yes or no? Does it involve music? No. <laughs> Water. Water. No. Water. 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 The involve <coughs> reading. 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 Does it involve reading? No. 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 Nice job. Uh, I think our uh, teammate got the answer faster. <laughs> so uh, the teammate won the game. <laughs> okay, uh, they need to go to their next class. Thank you, Brigitte. Thank you, Brigitte. Thank you, Brigitte. Thank you, Brigitte. Thank you all. Great job today. So see you next week. See you next week. All right. I will see you next week. Bye bye. Have a good day. See you.